Hello everyone, I am Dr. Jaskaran Singh Sahani. I am consultant pediatrician and neurologist at Chaitanya Hospital, Chandigarh. And today I am here to talk about Measles Immunization Day, which falls on 16th of March. Uh, before we proceed further, I'd like to talk about uh, the measles disease itself. Measles is a very uh, highly contagious and notorious uh, viral disease, which uh, spreads from direct contact between person to person and through the respiratory route in form of air droplets. From one person to another. This virus belongs to the Paramyxoviridae family and uh, has been responsible for a number of epidemics uh, in the last 8 to 10 decades worldwide as well as in India. And uh, the importance uh, of this measles virus lies in the fact that it is uh, it has associated with a lot of morbidity and mortality. It can lead to some serious manifestations in form of encephalitis that is brain swelling or brain infection pneumonias, that is lung infection, ear infections, sometimes severe diarrhea as well. Another important uh, aspect about this disease is that it is uh, it affects more in uh, children who are undernourished and whose uh, immunity is challenged and it can also lead to people, uh, it can also lead to devastating consequences in people who are immuno immunologically compromised. And uh, so it is very important that we get protection from this disease. The measles vaccine was first introduced in 1963 and since then it has uh, it has been associated with a lot of uh, success and uh, it is supposed to be the biggest uh, uh, initiative in the health regime which has uh, which has prevented a lot of deaths. In last uh, two decades from 2000 to 2018 the estimated number of deaths which has been prevented by measles vaccination is 2.3 million which is a huge number. and. Uh, that is why we should strive that uh, we continue with this success and prevent this uh, deadly virus from spreading around. The Talking about immunization schedule in India and the status of uh, immunization in India for measles, the immunization schedule in India recommends that two doses of measles vaccine be given, first between 9 to 12 months of age and the second between 16 to 24 months of age. Uh, the two vaccines are now available in a combination form. They are available in three different forms. That is MR, the MMR and MMRV vaccines. The MR stands for mumps and rubella combination, which was uh, first introduced in 2001 as a part of global initiative. And we also recently had trials throughout the country where MR vaccine was given to kids in schools as well as immunization centers worldwide, uh, countrywide. And, uh, the second, the conventional vaccine which was available is MMR, which includes measles, mumps and rubella. And the fourth one, the new kid on the block is MMRV vaccine, that is measles, mumps, rubella and varicella, that is the chickenpox vaccine. So combination of these vaccines together, I mean these viruses together in a vaccine help in co-distribution of, uh, of these antigens into our body and thereby stimulating immunity and protection from this disease. It is also very important to for, not to forget that two doses of measles vaccine is important because a single dose confers only 80 to 85 percent of protection. Giving two shots raises this protection to 95 to 98 percent. So it is important that we don't miss the second shot as well. The first shot being at 9 to 12 months and repeating, and second at 16 to 24 months of age. And uh, talking about common symptoms with which measles presents, it will generally present like a like a normal cough and cold in form of coryza, runny nose, coughing, watering of the eyes, and then it is followed by rash spreading, starting from the face and trunk and spreading to the whole of the body. The important part about uh, the viral exanthem associated with measles is that the patient who has been infected is contagious to other people before even the uh, the eruption of the rash and continues to do so even after the eruption of rash. So this is why the, it has a very high secondary infectivity rate. So my message for you today is that not to forget measles vaccination for your kid. Go out there, get your kid vaccinated, check your vaccination cards and two shots of measles vaccine have been given to them. Thank you.